Well, Lucinda, it's come to that stage in the film where we have to choose the roof tiles. And despite the fact we've only got the first floor on, uh, we do have to think in advance. Definitely. Because once again, it's not one of those simple decisions. No, the implications of your choice, you're going to be living with them for a very long time. So it's worth the half day you spend and researching and then looking at all the samples to get the right thing. And I know that the client originally really wanted to reclaim tiles. Uh, but uh, we have discovered that that's not as simple. I mean, finding 30,000 reclaimed roof tiles with the appropriate fixings in the correct colour. And the builders don't love working with reclaimed materials. It makes them very nervous. So generally, if it's possible to find something new, you're going to have a happier builder at least. And that's important. Uh, however, we stuck with the client's wishes and we did get some samples sent of reclaimed tiles. My problem with these ones, I think they're going to be too red. They've got soot on them, but if we power wash that soot off, I think they're going to be too red for what the client wants. Yes, you've got a brick house and I think that if with the slate, the, the roof tiles coming on not being a slate but being the tile, you don't want the whole thing to feel very red. No. You want to get some contrast colour and a softness and a sense of age to the roof. These ones, as we can see, have got what might be soot on them, but as you say, a good power wash, are you going to get, end up with an expensive choice, a fiddly choice, which actually has got the same colour as a newer tile? Yes. It's a worry. It's a worry. So let's look at these ones. These are actually handmade, but they are new. Okay. Some of the new tiles we've looked at have got lovely colour variation in them, which is very soft, very pretty. On a rendered house, could look charming, but your clients have got a brick house. We've got to remember to not get too much of that red colour coming in. And that's generally the worry with a classic red roof tile going on a red brick house. You risk it feeling a little bit mass built. So watch out for that. So we're just avoiding the two reds. So if we can bring the camera in now, we'll have a look at some of those new bricks. So here on the right, we have a sort of grainy, orangey look. I, I can see what they're trying to achieve again. We've got the sort of soot look. I think they're yeah. going for a sort of reclaimed feel. Yes. That's not dissimilar to the tiles we were looking at earlier with the sort of mixed up marking and a sense of age to it. Still feel they're a bit too red for our... I agree, I agree, I think they are. And then next to Lucinda, these to me seem far too orangey. Yes, there's a pretty colour variation in them. You can see you've got slightly more purple tones, the orange tones, the dark tones. But again, combined with those brick walls, I think it might be too much. So here, Lucinda, we have another choice. This one, I would say, is a bit closer to what we're looking for. What's your opinion? Oh, I think it's beyond a bit closer. I think this is a really successful choice. It's got all the merits of the older tiles that we were looking at earlier, with none of the impracticalities, and the colouring is very lovely. You can see the hints of the fact that it's a terracotta tile underneath, but this nice warm toning over the top of it is taking away that redness we were worried about. And what it's doing is complementing your brickwork rather than overwhelming it. I think your clients are onto a winner with this. One more thing to check with your reclaimed tiles is exactly how old is the reclaim? One imagines it might be a lovely sort of Victorian tile, but turning this one over, I can see that it's roof tiles by Sata, some handmade in Turkey. I'd say this is maybe 20, 30 years old, not 100. So don't pay over the odds for something just because it has the word reclaim in front of it. Make sure you know what you're getting.